Our recent media roundtable with Illinois Athletic Director Josh Whitman gave us the opportunity to ask pretty much whatever we wanted to the Illini boss, including the partnership between the U of I and IHSA. WCI3's Andy Olson has more on the success of State Hoops back in CU. Two years into the return of the IHSA State Basketball Finals to State Farm Center, the partnership between Illinois Athletics and the IHSA has flourished. We really value the relationship we have with the IHSA. It was important to us in, in making the effort to return the tournament to State Farm Center that we over-delivered on the promises that we had made, and I, I think that this year certainly demonstrated that. Experience Champaign-Urbana says ticket sales have increased from 34,000 sold in 2022 to over 40,000 sold this past season. And it's estimated the tournament has generated more than $5 million for the surrounding community. Experience CU Director of Sports Mike Kuhn says participating teams have been giving them great feedback. All positive about the site, the venue, the players being able to play the same place where the Illini team plays is a big deal. It fills much more like an event. With one year remaining on the original deal, an extension is still yet to be signed, but there is optimism from all parties involved that it will stay at the State Farm Center. The IHSA came to Champaign, decided to, to make the switch, feeling this was going to be their longtime home of the state basketball tournament. And I think that's the feeling we get from them. And now we have to continue to push that narrative forward and make sure that uh, our partners around town share in that excitement and, and that we, uh, we never take that tournament for granted because it's a, it's a great privilege to have it here and we're excited uh, for it to call us home for years to come. The state basketball finals are the second IHSA championship in Champaign-Urbana with wrestling while the area lost the football finals after 24 years to Illinois State. In Champaign, Andy Olson, WCIA 3 Sports.